Ben. typical morning routine in our house Monday to Friday um, Lindsay's just left for work and Jen and I are just playing but I think we might go for a walk now so I'll jump backwards to the beginning of the morning and um, yeah I hope you enjoy seeing how we start our day thanks for watching everyone bye Good morning, Jenny. Okay, so our day starts at about 6.15, our alarm goes off and generally we try to hop out of bed by half past six and then we just go into Jed's room and wake him up if he's not already awake. So Lindsay's just there with him, helping him out of his sleeping bag and I go over, open up the window, let some fresh air in. Doing your stretches? He's got his elephant there that he loves. Good morning, Ellie. And then I'm just going to go over to our feeding chair and wait for Lindsay to get Jed ready. So Lindsay leaves for work at 8 o'clock in the morning, which gives us about an hour and a half to do everything we need to do. We used to leave it till 7 o'clock to get up, but we found that getting up that half an hour extra really helps us just to not be rushed in the morning. So Jed and I are just feeding, well I'm feeding Jed here. Typically takes about 10 minutes in the morning. Um, usually pretty relaxed. And we've switched sides. And then we just look out the window or have a little chat. He can see the camera. <laughs> so Lindsay's just in the shower at the moment and we will stay in the room till he gets out of the shower. So yes, he does need his nails clipped. And I keep the nail clippers and cotton buds in this little drawer. But they're not there this morning. I just shut the door and we read some books and he pulls all the books off the shelf usually and I'm reading Winnie the Pooh to him at the moment. Good morning Pooh Bear, said Eeyore gloomily. It is a good morning, he said. Which I doubt. So Lindsay's out of the shower now and the <laughs> dog go downstairs and play for a bit and start breakfast while I get myself ready for the day. So I'm just making the bed here. I like to make the bed at the beginning of the day. I just feel like it gets things off to a good start. And lately I've also been doing some meditation, just a 10 minute guided meditation from an app. Once that's done, feeling nice and refreshed, I go in and have my shower. So here I'm just putting on a little bit of makeup. I think this day I didn't really have anywhere to go so it's just a bit of tinted moisturizer and um, one of my cheapy, I guess, foundations. And, um, you know, a bit of eyebrow work. If I knew that I was going somewhere, I'd uh, make a bit more effort with the makeup and whatnot. But even if I'm just going to be at home, I like to put on a little bit of something. I just feel like it gives 
a good start to the day so that if I do want to go out somewhere I'm kind of ready to go and it's easier to do when I don't have Jed at my feet in the bathroom so ready to go and then I just go back into our room and I get set up for Jed's morning sleep put out his sleeping bag and Hi! And the boys are having breakfast. Are you having a good breakfast? Yes! So funny how his hair held up over there. It's all neat. I think it's because there was coconut oil in the water. Oh, okay. It's, yeah, I was thinking that as well. It's not something we've seen before. <laughs> Very slick. He's <laughs> got a bit of a curl in the front. Curls get the girls. Right. Not. No girlfriends. <laughs> <laughs> I like to start my day with a glass of water and my vitamin, which is just a breastfeeding supplement at the moment. And I'm getting my breakfast, which is oats with some pumpkin seeds, sunflower seeds, buckwheat kernels and some sultanas. Oh. Ha! Look inside. <laughs> and we just have a little breakfast together. So Lindsay will just finish giving Jed his breakfast if we're running on time. If not, I'll finish it while he goes upstairs and gets ready. But on this day, I think we've got a bit of time up our sleeves. So we'll just wipe Jed's hands and face after breakfast, which he usually doesn't tolerate at all. And the kitchen's a little bit messy this morning. Most of the time we try to have it cleared the night before but then this morning we're just doing our bits, getting ready for work and tidying up and Lindsay's I'm taking Jet upstairs. Kinda. <laughs> okay. Good boys. Teeth brushing is a bit of a battle at the moment. <laughs> So now what I like to do is get Jed's room ready for his next nap. I shut the window, close the curtains. It's just easier without um, having to juggle holding Jed and doing this later on when it's nap time. So that's all ready to go. And I'm heading back down the stairs. And this morning I'm just cleaning up Jed's high chair, giving that a wipe and shaking out the mat, cleaning up the bench, doing a few bits and pieces just to get the day off to a good start before Lindsay gets ready to leave. And this is at around 8 o'clock. Oh, you don't want to come out? He always shuts it. He never tries to get through. Safety first, Jed. Yep, and then we go outside to say goodbye. Ooh. Bye. Bye. 
Mm -hmm. Bye, Jenny. I love you. Have a great day. Thanks, Dad. I'm gonna need those. <laughs> Thank you, mate. Let's go wave bye to Dad. Birdies, pigeons, go. <laughs> 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 So the time now is 8.30, um, so usually in the morning after Lindsay leaves to work we'll usually stay at home and just play. Sometimes we'll go upstairs and I'll put washing away while Jed plays around me. Or sometimes we'll go for a walk like we're doing this morning if we've got something to do. So I'm just taking a bag of donations to the Salvos. So that is our morning routine. Jed will be going down for a nap today around 9.30. And yeah, that's pretty much how our morning usually goes. So we'll just say bye now. Thanks for watching. Here's Jedi. If you're not already subscribed and you like the video, please give me a thumbs up and consider hitting subscribe. And I will talk to you guys soon. Okay.